The camel is a large mammal. The anatomy and physiology of these mammals are a clear indicator of their adaptability to life in harsh and arid environments. The camel has a strong, dense build, a long, U-shaped curved neck, and a rather narrow, elongated skull. The ears of the animal are small and rounded, sometimes almost completely buried in thick fur. The camel's large eyes are reliably protected from sand, sun, and wind by thick, long eyelashes. The blinking membrane, the third eyelid, protects the animal's eyes from sand and wind. The nostrils are shaped like narrow slits that can close tightly to prevent moisture loss and protect during sandstorms. Each camel's foot ends in a split leg with a sort of claw on a callous cushion. Bipedal feet are ideal for navigating rocky and sandy landscapes. Camels have a thick and dense coat that prevents moisture from evaporating in the heat and keeps them warm on cold nights. The wool of the camel is slightly curly, and its color can vary from light to dark brown to almost black. Contrary to popular belief, the camel's hump contains fat, not water. For example, the hump of a two-humped camel contains up to 150 kilograms of fat. The hump protects the animal's back from overheating and serves as a reservoir for energy reserves. There are two closely related species of camels, one-humped and two-humped camels, which have respectively one or two humps formed by the evolutionary development, as well as some differences related to habitat conditions. Camels retain fluid in the scar tissue of the stomach, so they calmly tolerate prolonged dehydration. The structure of camels' blood cells is such that in case of prolonged dehydration when other mammals would have died long ago, their blood does not thicken. Camels can do without water for a couple of weeks and survive for about a month without food. Without access to water for a long time, a camel can lose up to 40% of its weight. If an animal loses 100 kilograms in a week, it will quench its thirst for 10 minutes after receiving water. In total, a camel will drink more than 100 liters of water at a time and make up for the 100 kilogram of weight lost, recovering literally before its eyes. All camels have excellent eyesight. They can see a man for a kilometer and a moving car for 3 to 5 kilometers. They have an excellent sense of smell. They can feel the source of water at a distance of 40 minus 60 kilometers, and they can easily sense the approach of thunderstorms and go to the place where there are heavy showers. Even though the majority of these mammals have never seen large bodies of water, camels can swim well, tilting the body slightly to the side. The camel runs at a walking pace, with a speed of up to 23.5 km per hour. Some wild haptagai is capable of speeding up to 65 km per hour. Camels live exclusively in natural areas such as dry steppes, semi-deserts, and deserts. Areas with a humid climate are destructive for the animals. Previously, camels inhabited most of Central Asia, the Gobi and Takla Makan deserts, were widely distributed in Mongolia and China. In the east, the range of these animals reached the Great Bend of the Wanghe River, and in the west, it bordered Central Asia and Kazakhstan. Over time, the range area shrank considerably.